One, two, three, four. Come on, feel the song. Good, good. Okay, concentration. Concentration at the back. Okay, stop. Stop! Congratulations, that was abysmal. <laughs> One more time, shall we? One, two. One, two, three, four. Busy, I will not tolerate this. Do you know the song? I don't feel too well, Mr. Boyle. I think I have a stomach ache. How convenient. Funny how most students get stomach aches when they haven't practiced. Especially when there's a performance coming up. Shave up, people. This is a dress rehearsal. I'll be ready. One, two. One, two, three, four. on here. Elizabeth Ramon, sit down. When you gotta go, you gotta go. in a minute, boys. Hey, Busy, you all psyched up for the trip? My dad is. He wants the bus to run over my drum. <laughs> Later. Later, Busy. What are you doing here? You're not in the band. I am now. OK, people, let's get organized. Remember, this is our first out-of-town trip for our first real concert. Keep me happy. Move it along now, please. No horse play on the bus! So, Justin, Chrissy was giving you some pretty sweet looks today. <laughs> Justin, will you help me with my bag? Sure. Oh, Justin. Thanks. <laughs> Is uh, that seat taken? Uh, yeah. Yeah, sort of. I love it when you talk like that. Oh, man. Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to make do then. Nice dress she's almost wearing. Ow. So, is tonight the big night? Can you tell us anything? Sure, like I'd let you know. Come on, guys, lay off. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I'll handle it, Justin. Hmm? Yeah, Justin. She'll handle it. Woohoo! Just the other way! Yeah! See. So, I guess it looks like. Justin and Chrissy are back together again. Do you think you're obsessed with Justin? Okay, people. Hollywood, here we come!
Rooms have been assigned. Girls on one side of the building, boys on the other. I don't want any complaints about who's in what room with whom. No leaving the rooms after curfew, which begins at exactly 1900 hours. Miss Edwards and I will be patrolling the halls, which mean we may appear without warning. Is that clear? Hi, Jess. Hi. Wow, you look nice. Thanks. Um, you ready? Yeah, sure. So, uh, we're going to the coffee shop, right? Uh, um, quick, in here. and shine. Everybody up. Oh my God. Bus leaves in half an hour. Ah! Oh. oh my God. You're all ready to go. What? What? I fell asleep, okay? Yeah, right. We know all about it, Chrissy. Come on, Amanda. How was dinner? <laughs> Amanda saw them doing it right there in the broom closet. Right, Amanda? Well, yeah. I, I did. But it was... Wow. Man, Justin is such a stud. Pete, you got my uniform? Uh, yeah, stud. So. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Busy, I'm not sure exactly what happened. But for sure something was going on. Well, whatever was going on, it doesn't surprise me. I knew she was fast, but... Hey! Hey! Stallius! You really did it, man. Oh, man. Ah, maybe she wasn't that great. I must be wise not talking about Listen. I told you before, and I'm gonna tell you again. Nothing happened. So you're serious? You spent the entire night in a closet with Chrissy Fraser, and you didn't get anywhere with it. That's pathetic. <laughs> well, I can't honestly, truly say that nothing happened. Yeah. Oh, right. Just <laughs> She is, guys. Come and get it. <laughs> Chrissy in the closet. <laughs> <laughs> Justin, what did you tell them? I, I mean, they knew already. Don't try to cover up, sleaze bucket. You were gone all night. Amanda Zim's on the whole thing. Thanks a lot, Zim. Hi. Fuck her up, Emery! <laughs> For our next number, we'd like to speed back through the years to our favorite decade, the 70s, and our favorite songbirds. Nice dress, slut. 
Give it up, monkey face. Again, get on the bus this instant! I got it, guys. Chrissy in the can. You see this, Michael? You've kept the entire bus waiting. A 500-word essay, please, on my desk Monday morning. Tight. <laughs> Tight. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Welcome, ladies. Everyone present and accounted for. Good. Let's go. What? That's it? Why aren't you yelling at them for being late? You sent it to me to type it for the same thing. Michael, the girls were late for a reason. I don't get this. That's so unfair. I was late and they were late. What's the difference? Why should a guy be treated differently than a girl? Guys are always treated differently than girls. Aren't they, Justin? I mean, a guy does something and everybody thinks He's great. A girl does the same thing, and everybody thinks she's a sleaze. Get much sleep last night? Shut up, Pete! Deoxyribonucleic acids are found in the nucleus of cells and function in the transference of genetic characteristics. Let me. Here you go. Thanks. And now the moment you've all been waiting for. Your marked test papers from last week. I just don't get this. Corey. Listen. Good effort. What's a quality both you and your dad have? Jennifer, it's coming along nicely. We both need to clean up. Okay, then think of it this way. This little piece of his DNA, the one labeled messy, probably got transferred into your genes. So it's my dad's fault that I'm a slob? Right. So next time he tells you to clean up your room... I'll just blame it on his DNA. Eve. Top-notch work as usual. Troy, what can I say, Mr. Edwards? Don't quit your day job. And remember, class, next week's test will be 40% of your final mark. <laughs> 